Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing fine today. If you haven't yet, please subscribe. It's free, full of adventure. I do give fashion advice twice a week, Tuesday and Thursday. I'm sorry about that. Thank you a lot. I was saying, I do give fashion advice twice a week. I'm always there, so you have no reason not to see me at all for the week. I do have Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and uh, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat as well as my new website which is www.eatpreentshop.com you're gonna find a lot of lot of stuff I have a blog for it, I have a monthly digital magazine and I'm gonna be next week because it's gonna be the April edition so get ready for that, get excited for that probably gonna make a few changes on my website but I'm gonna let you know as soon as I do it but definitely guys check it out advice fashion related advice when it comes to fashion in general because i love it but um yes it's pretty much it today was all about styling what i call a basic for spring or fall which is a trench coat for me this is like the kind of other words that i'm gonna show you guys it's gonna be everything that you can actually dress up or dress down. There was all about it. I showed you three outfits. They were all different and I do that all the time because for you it's all about being able to find your own style in everything that I'm gonna show you of course. The one that I showed you was this one. Really 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 colorful compared to like a basic trench coat because basic trench coat tend to be a little bit more like light brown or notice color on H&M and I'm gonna link it in the description box below as usual it's really really vibrant it's a trend for this year it's a trend for spring and to me it was not about just styling a trench coat for me it was all about styling a trench coat which would be different from every type of trench coat that you've seen so far it was super long as you saw in the lookbook part of it of course definitely 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 love this trench coat because it's like the color again is a vibrant and because it's like simple there's not any details to it it's just a way to actually like i said 
match it with a lot of outfits, a lot more outfits that you actually can do if you have a printed trench coat, for example. That prints, printed coats are not something that you can match easily with anything you have in your closet. It's just that when you have a plain and vibrant color such as this one, I find it really easier for me personally to really style it the way I want and have much more option compared to another one that would be printed. The outfit right now, so let's get to it. My first outfit was with this a scarf from Zara on one of my haul and my first video of the week actually. That which are the big trends this year again for spring are so nice and what I did is that for this outfit everything was much more dress down with this really nice up from myself <laughs> so I have a really nice t-shirt that I could print my little website name on it I think it was so nice a nice plain t-shirt paired up with my pants from Zara that you saw a long time ago because it's like has this really nice details on the bottom and then again the details on the pants itself I find really really cute. I have to have the same pants but I think it's just the style of it and it's a super 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 cute. The back is really nice. That's pretty much it for this outfit. Super 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 cute, super simple. I paired the whole outfit with really nice sneakers and have my heart on sneakers at the moment. It's crazy. Somebody that used to like it but right now I, I would die for sneakers. I would just die for sneakers. There are these nice uh, sneakers from Zara. You saw that many times as well. I think the color again here is just amazing. With the coat, it's not necessarily the same color, but like I said, when you have a color family and that you can find a little bit of like color theme or color related theme on the on one of your accessory, you can create it because you can just like mix match the color that are actually really close together and it's just gonna give you a really nice a visual appeal, like I love to say all the time. If you're that kind of like laid back type of girl, you're gonna love this outfit. My second outfit was a much more a chic. It was almost the opposite, I would say. With this nice a skirt from Zara. Again, here you don't have the same color, but you have a color family. And this skirt is a so 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 much more chic. You'll be able to just dress up that kind of basic trench coat. I paired it with this nice a sweater, which is like cut out on the shoulders, and. Uh, it was all simple and that's something that I liked a lot. I think they go really, 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 really well together just because the skirt in the middle has a lot of, a lot of shades, a lot of, lot of colors that actually you can, you can find on the top and on the cut. So it's just a really nice visual appeal when you mix them together. They both are really warm so they are easy to match together. You can do so much with that kind of color and that kind of color theme. And spring, I think this sky is the limit when it comes to matching colors. Love it because I feel like I can actually create almost a lot of lot of outfits just because you can mix match pretty much any color you want. Was it for the second outfit? I think they were super cute. It was that kind of girly girly type of look and if you saw my earrings, again they added that kind of a chicness to it. Everything was just like much more chic, like the opposite. So to me it was all about playing with all of that and playing again here with colors because it's spring. So I really hope you liked it. It's definitely for the girly girl out there that I am myself somewhere. But yes, I'm a really girly girl. So I think it's so cute for me to just have that kind of outfit. I'm gonna get to the last outfit, which is the third one. Much more laid back, but the, with a little bit of chicness to it. Again, one with this a really nice sweat. What I did here was to pair it with my embellished jean from Zara also mattered here a lot. The jean is so vintage looking and there is so much details to it that it's the same thing that I said for the skirt it's gonna go well with the trench coat. A lot of colors here. You have a lot of like gold accent, silver accent, you have a lot of things going on on the skirt and um, just because the trench itself is a 
really nice plain color it's gonna go well with it them together you kind of see like the red go well with that kind of orange or burn orange color from the trench I believe here again was all about mixing matching details color everything about it I did it with the belt just because the chin is a little big on me no surprise here all about it it was all about that and i think for this third outfit what i love the most about it is probably the fact that it was laid back but again really chic because it has that it had that kind of sophisticated look but vintagey or edgy look i loved it a lot and it was much more edgy just because of, of the details on the pants paired with the trench coat so i really hope you liked it i really really hope you enjoyed That's it all about it for today for this video i hope you liked it i hope you enjoyed it and uh, please again subscribe share it if you really really do enjoy it because i love i love i love doing fashion and this is just something this is just something that naturally i'm just drawn to so let me know what you think about it in the, the comment box down below until then i will see you guys next week and of course smile because it's free bye